Plug it in and get ready to rock. Sit your ass down with the hands of the clock. We renegade pineapple so sublime. Like, comment, subscribe. It's game time! Yeah! Hello! Hello! And welcome back to West of Dead. The Western in Destiny. Darn tootinous, brutinous experience. Dead. It's like a full immersive experience. Actually, it's not. It was if we were actually in the West, but we're kind of in a cold level. But in real life, it's too freaking hot. Yeah. If you can hear fans and stuff, I'm sorry. This is probably doing us a favour. We can envisage being in yeah. the cold. We, well, we can imagine it for this episode because we've both put fans on to try and cool the fuck down. Yeah. And I've opened up all my windows. So if you hear some kids yelling, I'm sorry, but otherwise the, my laptop's going to explode. Back off, I mean, as long as those kids start yelling like West expressions, like darn tootin', it's all good. <laughs> yeah, as long as they start yelling about getting the gold, <laughs> then, it, then it adds to the immersion. It's all good. Look at this guy that didn't attack me. The dogs came for me, but that guy with the dynamite was just like, I'll stay here. He seems fine. Oh my god, he shot me. Oh, he, sh he shot me. <laughs> I didn't even do anything. I was just holding dynamite. Best I wasn't going to use it. That's the thanks I get for not throwing dynamite at you. <laughs> Here's the gun that I nearly paid for. I can see what it does. Whoa. It does nine for each shot. I'm so glad I didn't buy that. I don't care how much bleed it does. Nine instead of yeah. 30. Fuck that. Nah. Oh, upgrade. Hello. There's another ghost organ. Yes, there also might be a little uh, tweety bird that loves to sit next to my window and be a real fucking dick that you might hear during this episode. Who I have, like, really bad insomnia, as Nathan well knows, but everyone yeah. watching might not. And sometimes I'm like, like, the last couple of nights, for example, I think the heat doesn't help. I'm, like, trying to sleep at, like, five in the morning when everyone should be asleep. And these bastard birds are just waking up. And there's this one bird that I'm sure lives in, like, right next to my window that just goes, eh, 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 eh. Like it's and it's like an alarm <laughs> going <trying> off. <laughs> it's Good just luck. such a constant one noise. And I can't see what that even means to other birds. What is it communicating by making the same noise over <laughs> and over again? That would be like, that's like that Alan Partridge bit where he's like, Steve, Steve, Steve. <laughs> it's like that, but a fucking bird. Dan, Dan. <laughs> I, I, nah, he's not seeing me. I'll get him later. Dan. <laughs> Who are you talking to, bird? Shut up. And then the bird became Alan Partridge. It is Alan Partridge the bird. It actually has its own radio show on North <laughs> Norfolk Digital. And uh, should I continue putting my health up or my damage? damage. I can't. I don't really give a shit about the resourcefulness because it, it's a, your ability item. So my axe and my dynamite currently is what I've got for that. But I feel like I don't really see that. It's not the most useful thing. I'll put up my damage, fuck it. Yeah. I could probably do with healing soon. I could heal now for safety, but I'll be pissed if I find health. Oh, there's health in that room, I can see a green flask. There you go, lucky I didn't do it. Very. Oh, there's a big man, there's a big man. Don't like the big men. Ah, uh, jump over the oh, thing. Oh yeah. Right, get rid of the guy with the gun first. And there's a dog man chasing you. Alright, got the guy with the gun. He's the more important one to make sure that it gets down because the big guy's pretty slow. Dog's down. He just tried to do his like big move and did it into a fucking thing next to it. What an idiot. So he like throws that giant sword thing that he's carrying. So he just did that into a wall. Genius. Yeah, it, like right next to him as well. It went nowhere. There we go, you're down. Alright, let's get this health. Yes, please. And there's more health there. Thank you, game. I'm glad I didn't heal. That means I can retain my flask for whatever comes afterwards, because there's bound to be some big old shit that tries to kill me. Uh, let's go down this way first. Double barrel pistol. Is it better than the one I'm holding? 
Slightly better. Slightly better damage. Oh, it's got more than nine hit points, so... Ah! Ah! Open the... What? Is that a metal door? Oh, oh, I've never had that before. That wasn't in the beta. Does dynamite do it? No. Did I just hurt myself? I hope not. Oh, there must like be another it, way really... around or something, then. I don't think your health has gone down. I hope not. I hope I didn't just blow myself up with dynamite. That's like a real Western <laughs> faux pas. <laughs> like... That's the sign you don't know what you're doing. Yeah, that's a faux pas no matter what era you live in. Yeah, I suppose. <laughs> but I mean, it feels more common for Western times. Stun, please. Then I can throw dynamite at that arsehole. I keep shooting me. I hate these. The second level really bumps up from the first one. Just because the dogs coming at you all the time makes you move around more. And then you I, just get shot because you're trying to escape the dogs. I hate those dogs. Fuck off. Alright, I might have to Leave use my flask now. Alright, I'm going to flask. Because otherwise I'm going to die. Hey, that's oh, quite well, a lot of health. I could do with a bigger flask though. You can upgrade the flask. Maybe it's worth putting points into the medium flask. That gives you, what, 100 hit points back again? That was 100, yeah. So I think... The medium flask maybe does 150 and then the large one's 200. It depends how much... I don't know how much life it's going to be by the time you get to the full version of the game. So maybe it's bigger than that still. Which would mean the second flask is very worth it. What is that? With its weird mole claw hands. Oh, it's not attacking me while I'm shooting it in the back. Whatever it is, it's thick as shit. Either that, or it's just very, very despondent. Ah. Why am I even Oh god, here? that thing was terrifying. It just keeps shooting me, I don't care. <laughs> oh, another big guy. Just anything to get me out of these caves. Oh, he did the big throw. Oh, damn, he's got a cleave. I have not noticed that. He's down. Fuck you. Oh, I really need to pick up some better guns, though. I could do with a better second gun. I, a shotgun that shot more than one bullet at a time would be nice. Ah, uh, Decisive Blade. Does critical on stunned enemies, but you have to be right up next to him to use it. Another which I'm not a big fan of. No. Uh, were there paths we didn't take? Yes, there's another path we didn't take. So the red block there is probably that metal one that we can get through but we should go down the other path to see what else is around only way i'd find out is by going through so let's go back and then up this path there we go that's new oh different axe is that better than my current axe uh so same points. damage but quicker cooldown just slightly quicker, not hugely anyway. Yeah, but any improvements better than no improvement. Uh, I'm also going to just quickly... I want to swap those two rounds. There we go. Ah, shit, it's the Wendigo. Oh, Wendigo. 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 Oh, alone. fuck, it just came right at my fucking face. That was poor choice of words, but that's what happened. Wendy, get out of my face. Oh, there's barely any cover in here as well. Oh, oh look at that dodge, though. I'm that, disappointed you're not smushing that oh. Wendy guy. Oh, come on, shoot. Oh, I dodged again, but then it still got me because I dodged in the path of where it was going. Is it stunned? Have everything. Oh, the oh, dodging! No. I've only just seen your health too. Oh, yeah. Oh, fuck. I didn't even notice that. Oh, it killed me. Fuck, I dodged and it still got me. Oh, Shit. You know what's annoying? You were so close to killing it. Yeah, but this is why you need the better weapons and have to do it a couple of times. That's fine. We're getting our revenge on the goddamn Wendigo. I'm not. 
I'm not going to not let it live. I mean, I'm oh, sorry, no, wait, that's the opposite of what I meant. I'm not going to let it live. <laughs> We're going to kill that fucking thing. It smushed me twice now. Ah, you're back in the bar. Back for another drink. Pure. Ah, Wendigo got you. I, yep. I don't, I don't care about this conversation every time. Yes, you die and you come back. I get it, Ghost Man. Right, so we'll get different weapons this time. Flintlock pistol. Oh god, they're terrible. It's two pistols. I don't want two pistols, I want a rifle. Right, hopefully we pick up some good shit. Because <laughs> our starting ones are fucking trash. You might get a stronger rifle this time around as well. Yeah, exactly. I might find something good, but definitely our starting ones are crap. It might make it easier to defeat the Wendigo if I can get, like... If I had two rifles, that would actually be decent as well. Maybe I should have done that last time. Because as much as it's just as slow, it means that I've got more ammo to fire before having to reload. All right, we're going with damage first this time because I've got weak piss guns. And the first level's pretty piss easy. Uh, back this way... There must be enough iron for me to pick up and then buy the... Oh, that's where I came out from. Uh, to buy that workhorse rifle, which is really good because I can shoot five bullets instead of three without reloading. Which would make quite a huge difference, really. Yeah. Especially fighting the fucking Wendigo. Uh... Alright, take out the little guys. You see, this level's so... Ah, oh, shit. I was just about to say it's so easy and then I got shot. <laughs> Make myself ah, look like an asshole. A curse of speaking too soon. I couldn't even see this motherfucker. Get rid of the little guys. Get rid of the gun guys. Alright, that one's down. What? Everyone looks like old soldiers. I suppose it's supposed to be everyone who's died. Yeah. So <laughs> that kind of makes sense. Alright, let's upgrade the health now. Still gonna focus myself. Hey, wait, this looks. Oh, it's a shotgun, but still. What's the damage? Uh, I can get rid of this little thing. 36, so it's still a decent first level gun. Oh, and quick reloading. That's also nice. For once, fate seems to be on my side. Oh, the range on the shotgun is awful. <laughs> Gotta get super up close for it to do anything. Got to stand next to them for it to do anything. It might as well be a knife at this point. Oh, that's just a box. But gun knife. It's a knife that shoots guns. Or a gun that shoots <laughs> knives. That is an actual weapon in Enter the Gungeon. In Enter the Gungeon, there is actually a gun that shoots guns as well. Like, it's a shotgun that fires out other guns, and when they hit things, they all fire. <laughs> That's like the inception uh, of guns. Stick with that. Oh, you're too close, mate. Ah, god damn it! Didn't notice the guy down the bottom. Leave me alone! I just want to lift my. So I had this. Kill that Wendigo. I'm not. Cl <laughs> I'm only here for the Wendigo. That's all I actually care about. I just want my revenge. No one smushes me. I'm the flamey skeleton man. I had a name once. It was... I don't know. I don't know what it was. I'm just flamey skeleton man now. The fucking Wendigo stole my name. You also stole my horse. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> uh... 
All right, get super close to me. Boom. I suppose with these little guys that just walk around, I could just wait until they're next to me and then use the shotgun, but I really need a rifle. All right, so that's the exit, but I need the weapons that are on this floor and the upgrades. There should, I think there's one more upgrade. Is it, oh, no, maybe it's two per thing. Either way, I still need to find better weapons, and I know this one of the other paths is bound to have better weapons than what I've got. Uh... Pew! Pew! I feel like a flintlock ah, pistol is more of ah. like a small explosion. Aren't flintlock pistols like really old school pistols as well? Yeah. It would be like using a musket, wouldn't it? It would be the same kind of... Like, just an... It's a handheld explosion. Oh, hello, what's this? That's a fucking shotgun again. Uh, I might buy just the charm thing again, then. Yeah, the charm's useful. God damn it. I don't need another one of the same shotgun. I suppose that means I could do loads of damage really up close. It'd have to be, like, the riskiest run of this game. Where you stand like an inch away from everyone with a musket. And you have to get 100% accuracy every time. Oh, well, you're dead. Otherwise you just get shot in the goddamn face. Yeah. Or pounce them by the Wendigo. Is there another path here? Uh, oh man, the other path is like quite far back. Oh no, there's one here as well. Yeah, let's do down here. Ah, uh, and this is the... Oh! Whoa. I just jumped off the level! That's useful! Alright, so I, I can't use this. This is the thing that teleports you to the other side. Which we don't have whatever upgrade makes us do that. So let's walk back to that other bit. And hope that we get some more guns! Well, if that Wendigo didn't steal a horse, we could have ridden to the other side. But no! Yeah. <laughs> we could have gone there in style. We could have, like, trotted or... Cantered or other horse things. Doing their little horse dances. We used to be a dressage champion. <laughs> <laughs> and then the Wendico came. Yeah, and then <laughs> took our Olympic medal away because they were better than us. <laughs> we won silver for the first time because the Wendigo was so good. He was so good. And great he didn't even have a horse. It was both the rider and the horse. <laughs> well, I can see how it appealed to the judges. I mean, that, if they're both the person and the horse, then that's just... That's just a person dancing. That's cheating. Right, give cheating. me something good, you son of a bitch. Ah, fucking dynamite. I came back here for dynamite. God damn it. Alright, let's switch those two. Ah, uh, that's everywhere, isn't it? That's the whole floor, I think. Other than that bit that I can't get through. Yep. Yeah. Okay, we'll go to the second level with our fucking no rifle. Well, I feel like rifles are the point of this game. I feel like the, it's the main weapon it gives you when you start the game up in the tutorial. It, it's like the weapon that it wants you to use. And we have found not a one so far. Nope. Can't Even in the shots. I couldn't even buy one. That's horseshit. Oh, horseshit. That just reminded me of my horse. <laughs> oh, 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 Dumper. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, Dumper. Why did you leave Dumper. us? Dumper. Yes. That's what the horse Dumper. is called. Dumper. <laughs> it was good at dancing and pooping. <laughs> Those were its two main skills. Oh, Dumper. Both at the same time. I hardly knew ye. That was just like. <laughs> That's like its big finale <laughs> at the end of the dance. It just did like a spiral and a fountain of shit came out. This is why you don't want to sit in the first three rows of these shows. Yeah. <laughs> Wear a poncho. <laughs> oh, does this mean we're going to get wet? Uh... No. Yes and not no. Wet, wet. <laughs> 
<laughs> yes, yes, wet, but not in the way that you're thinking. <laughs> Alright, let's see if I can buy the... I wear this helmet, but but I've just done my hair. I, I don't want it to... Trust me, you'll Sorry. want to wear the helmet. <laughs> the, the poops are hard as hell. <laughs> Right, we've got the workhorse, which now means that I can take it as well. It's like it's raining. Oh no, the workhorse! <laughs> it reminded me of my horse again! No! Dumper! Dumper! <laughs> the dancing workhorse at Dumps! <laughs> wow, he had a lot of strings to his bow. That's the work it did, dumping. <laughs> it, it, it pooped for a living. It was a job for this goddamn horse. He was the number one dumper of the fields. <laughs> it fertilised so many fields with its <laughs> huge, rock-hard, yet somehow wet turds. <laughs> it's like, um... He was it was a like being fertilizer spreader. <laughs> Booed in one it end. It was like being hit with other. a moist brick. <laughs> Oh, why can't I? Oh, it's up the top. Fuck. I don't like that at all. Is that the only person in the room? Yeah, it is. Alright, climb, 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 you son of a bitch. I'm gonna get hit by a person I can't attack. Dumper's one big flaw was he was a raging alcoholic. Which was probably why, <laughs> yeah, the dumping. That's what made all of the poops out as well, because <laughs> they lived on a, a diet of bourbon. Yeah. <laughs> Bourbon and pork scratchings, which I'm not even sure how a horse could consume them. Ugh. I can't consume pork scratchings, <laughs> so good luck to that horse. It's fucking vulgar. <laughs> hey, I never said Dumper was a respectable horse. He was disgusting. So all, all, so all this horse consumes is alcohol and roasted fat. <laughs> yeah. Great. That explains this fucking turd monster. How did it get the turds out in the first place? <laughs> With its poops like a boulder that has gone through a river. He like craps out suits of armour. <laughs> <laughs> you mean he can like poop into shapes? <laughs> That's another Like a play to his <laughs> <laughs> it does like star shaped poops. <laughs> he was so talented. <laughs> a horse that was trained to clench stencils in its butt cheeks so that it could poop in fun shapes. Oh no, no stencils. It was free rectum, I guess. Oh, it, it, it just had the skills. Yeah, it just had mad skills. <laughs> you wouldn't even call it free. It would be free rectum. Can't call it free hand. <laughs> it just clenched its arsehole in such a way it could make talent. any shape upon request. Also, another string to its boat. Apparently it understood human language because you could request the shapes. <laughs> 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 no one... I, I'd never thought about this with old Dumper, but he must have understood us very well. <laughs> because when I said poop in a heart shape... Boy, did it poop in a heart shape. I gave you a wink. Every Valentine's <laughs> Day. <laughs> he even wrote the cards as well. <laughs> wrote them in shit. I am hard for you. Wink. The cards were made of shit. The words were in shit. <laughs> oh, now destroy the thing. Thank you. All this talk. Of, Give me that iron. All this talk of dumper. Ah, oh. <laughs> oh, the good old days. <laughs> and then the wind came. With me and my came boy along. dumper. Oh, I just shot at nothing. And then the wind the came along blade? with his regular poo. Oh, the decisive blade is a extra. Oh, maybe this is useful. Thirty seconds. I might take the blade instead of the reload thing. I always forget that the reload thing exists, to be honest, so... Might as well take the blade. Yeah. Let's switch those around. And then I can do it as like an extra attack if anything gets too close and I run out of shotgun ammo. Hello? Has anyone seen my horse? That's what he's really there <laughs> for. He's just trying to be reunited with Dumper. Dumper! 
dump of the show jumper. Oh, I missed. Fuck's sake. I just used the fucking, like, knife thing and I just completely whiffed. The dog was nowhere near, apparently. And they're stunned. Fuck you. Did you just say dump of the show jumper? Yes. Was it also a show jumper as well as dressage? Yep. It was like he did a so horse much. equivalent of... Oh, the game has frozen. Oh, we're back. It was like the horse equivalent of like a triathlon. It, yeah. <laughs> it does the dressage and the show jumping. And the and dumping. Is there another horse thing? <laughs> is pooping part of the Olympics? <laughs> well, it is now. Uh, there was another path back there, but let's go this way. I can I can start to see why the Wendigo wanted him now. <laughs> the Wend this was a very impressive horse. <laughs> Wait, is that a path or is that a nothing? That's a nothing. That's just a weird corner. Oh, I don't trust this room. Yeah, I don't like the way that camera angle changed. Yeah, it, it was very much like, there's big things in this room. Oh, it's one of those mole guys and it's actually attacking me this time. Which I don't like. They're like smaller win Wendigos. You've got to get the dodges right for that shit. Ooh. Oh, they're, they're like easier to dodge though. Was that the thing that was hiding in the corner Fuck last you. time? Was like, I don't even care anymore. Yeah, it was the thing that was just facing the other way. I don't know what it is. It looks like some kind of angry fraggle. Uh, that's the same as what I've already got. Fucking fraggles with their anger. They need to calm down. In fairness, How do you're I in get that through steel doors? This is this is Fraggle <laughs> Island. This is full of the fraggles. Fraggle Rock. I've never really seen the fraggles. That's a weird, th weird thing that I reference but have never seen. <laughs> they were just like, they were muppety things, right? Yeah. <sighs> yeah Did you see that they're I've making more muppets? Anything close to the fraggles was on Robot Chicken. That's pretty much the only reason I know what they are. Oh, uh, is there like a parody of them? Do you see they're making a new Muppets show? Are they? Yeah. They look like an improv Muppets show. It's going to be on Disney Plus, guys. This is not an advert for Disney Plus or anything. I'm just saying, I like the Muppets, so I was just excited that I saw that earlier today. Yeah, I haven't got Disney Plus. Also, I've just noticed that we're like very over time. I've not been looking at the clock because I've been talking about this goddamn horse and its boots. <laughs> Clear this room and then... Uh, also, I'm dying right now. Use the... Sword! Oh, God, you have to be, like, an inch away from whatever you're shooting. All right. Turn that on. Fuck off. Fuck off. I'm going to have to heal up now. Yep. All right, here's my flask. Okay, right, that's it for this episode. It was like an extra seven, eight minutes because of the horse talk. <laughs> <laughs> I stopped looking at the thing at all. Because of all. Right, that's it for this episode. See you next time. Goodbye. Goodbye. Dumper! Dumper, no, come back to me. <laughs> yep, that's totally how the joke came off. <laughs> like Nigel Thornberry. <laughs> Smashing, Batman. Do you want to know how I've got these scars on either? <laughs> <laughs>